Hey yo, what is going on boys? It's your boy Wish You Luck, back at it again with another YouTube video. Um, today's video is going to cover the highly sought after Wish, what's your opinion on the Crucible Changes uh, topic? So, we are going to run through the Destiny weapon tuning for Rise of Iron, word for word, sentence for sentence. I promise I won't bore you guys. We'll get straight to the real shit. We won't go to the fucking bullshit like <gasps> the Fabian strategy. No one gives a fuck. No one cares, okay? No one fucking cares about the Fabian strategy. All right, let's get straight to it. Thorn. Nerfed for no fucking reason. Read it and weep, boys. Shit on. They reduced the base range by Thorn by 25%. Anyone who doesn't know what happens when Bungie reduces range, we get more ghost bullets. Now, people, are, I've, I've talked to a couple people who have said, I barely notice a difference because generally you use Thorn mid to close range anyway, hand cannons, you know? Anyway, Thorn completely unwarranted nerf. What the fuck was the actual point of it? Iceland was already better than the Thorn. Why are we nerfing this? They said to, to, to so we didn't have to like run into year one again. Thorn is not even close to what it was in year one, okay? Come on, that's a bullshit excuse. It didn't need it. Uh, Universal Remote, thank God this got nerfed. Thank God. You have no idea how frustrating it was. To play against universal remotes and trials so thank you bungo appreciate it thank you um drake's promise no one cares touch of malice they nerfed it <laughs> uh bully and gemini no, no time to explain no time to care uh snipers this was the extremely 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 sought after topic or uh topic of discussion rather on twitter the other day so let's go word for word what bungie says okay okay Snipers are being utilized extremely effectively in both the Crucible and against the minions of the darkness. However, one family of sniper rifles stands out from the rest, the mid to high impact family of sniper rifles, of which Thousand Yard and Longbow Synthesis belong. Let us evaluate the benefits of the family. Decent mag size, strong target acquisition, ability to take down a guardian in their super, high body shot damage. Pretty fucking strong snipers, right? Resulting sniper has all the strengths of other families but without the drawbacks. So, to spread the power a bit, we touch two elements. They reduce the damage on the mid to high impact snipers by 7%. They reduce the target acquisition or aim assist of for the LDR and longbow synthesis to bring in line with other snipers in the same family. As a result, the slowest firing family of sniper rifles, the black spindle, should be your key tool to take down supers balanced by lower mag size, fire rate, and aim assist. All right, boys, this is where it gets interesting. Why? So we all we all pretty much agreed that snipers did way too much to the body, right? 170 damage body shot from 1,000 yard or whatever, that's way too freaking much, okay? Everyone could agree on that. Snipers should have been brought down to about 130 damage body shot, still making it stronger than the other options. However, you know, prioritizing hit the damn headshot. Correct? Okay. Why is sniping a super in the head not a kill anymore? That has to be the most casual friendly thing I've ever read in my life. Oh, you popped your super? Wait, you're in a storm trance or, 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 or a sunbreaker? You're in your super? It's fine. Run in straight lines. Run down sniper hallways. Don't give a fuck who's staring at you. Just run at them. No, nothing's gonna happen. You, you, like literally today, in today's stream, I was playing it as soon as I popped my storm collar, I felt invincible. I was not afraid to challenge any lanes in the Crucible and I never died using it. It's actually so stupid that snipers were reduced to this level, like this level of, of, of non-effectiveness. They're just not useful anymore. One thing I've noticed in the Crucible is that a lot less snipers are popping up. You see a lot more shotguns, you see a lot more fusions, you see a lot more sidearms. Video coming on the Trespasser, the new exotic sidearm that's fucking terrible. Um, anyway, that's my take on snipers. Completely unnecessary nerf. You won't see them in competitive play anymore. You won't see snipers really in Crucible that much. Um, they can't snipe self resers No one's going to put on a goddamn black spindle. Who the fuck cares about that sniper? Bit ruined, boys. A bit ruined. A bit ruined. Man, this music's getting kind of loud, eh? Let's, let's hope it doesn't fuck up the video. I'm just gonna keep talking. Um, aim deflection, aka flinch. 
So, I love this change. I think flinch needed to be worked on. I, I hated hawk sawing people in the head just to get sniped in the face after like the second burst. That triggered me so much. So thank God for this flinch increase. Um, people like Sir Demetrius in the community and other big snipers are saying it's not that bad. You can still snipe through it. Um, but it's definitely noticeable. It is definitely still noticeable. Um, ARs, they increase the damage to uh, middle rate of fire autos, but they're still not, you know, they're still not usable in the Crucible. You're still going to get outclassed by a Hawksaw or I Luna. You're still going to get destroyed by them. So auto rifles definitely still need a buff. Shotguns, they didn't really touch shotguns. Um, in general, they touch very specific shotguns. Um, but they didn't really mess with shotguns too much. So shotguns are still the same. Pulse rifles, once again, um, they didn't really do much to the pulse rifles. They minor increase 2% damage for the middle rate of fire family pulse rifles and Nero's Mercy. You, you, don't, you still don't see these guns in the Crucible. Like, these guns are not viable at all. It's still hand cannon. It's still Hawksaw or PDX. That's it. Um, sidearms. All this right here, all this is saying right here, you see this right here, boys? This entire note section is saying, does not fucking matter. Does not matter. Literally doesn't matter. You don't see sidearms in the Crucible. Shotguns get the job done a lot faster, a lot more effectively with a lot less ammo and a lot less trigger pulls. Um, rocket launchers, grenades and horseshoes got nerfed. I could understand it a little bit, but um, I didn't see the point. Honestly, everyone uses truth anyway. And truth was not affected by the change, so kind of useless. Machine guns, increased damage on high rate of fire machine guns. No, 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 nothing big, who cares. Uh, hand cannons, they didn't change anything to the hit registration, so fuck these notes. Uh, fusion rifles, no one cares. Perks, no one cares. They even made unflinching worse, boys. Decreased efficacy of the perk from 25% to 15 percent um, and they still don't know how to fix firefly uh, that's gonna do it for this video boys those are my raw opinions on this goddamn patch this patch seems to be extremely stupid it seems to be slowing down the crucible even more and i really 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 hope that they decide to start talking to us big community members within the pvp community because i think we can help i really think we can help but i don't think Bungie will like suck up their pride and come talk to us who knows one day boys one day that's gonna do it for me hopefully you guys enjoyed the video as always it's your boy wish you luck signing off